workers. Embattled wolf workers approving a new contract today that will keep their jobs in Wisconsin. The deal comes nearly a month after employees rejected a 20% pay cut. It's a story we first shared tonight on Live at 5. The night team's Margot Spann joins us with more on the vote and our top story, Margot. Eric, the business agent for the union tells me it was difficult for workers to accept this agreement simply because it was similar to what they shot down several weeks ago. It's a victory for, a jo for jobs, but it is a defeat for the wages and benefits that we had previously collectively bargained. By a vote of 110 to 89, Wolf Appliance workers in Fitchburg agreed to a five-year wage freeze and a 20% pay cut. Goodspeed says this new agreement changed the way the pay cut is structured. In the first three months, the uh, concessions would only amount to 5% of the wage benefit package. In the second three months, it would be 10%. The third three months uh, would be 15%. And by the, time, uh, by the time we hit October 2011, the full 20% would take uh, would take effect. He says the company also extended the length of time laid off workers can be called back to work. Before it was six months, now it's up to 12. He says the bottom line is 209 jobs won't be going to Kentucky. The jobs will stay in the, uh, the Madison, Fitchburg area um, at least until October 2018. Workers we talked with declined to go on camera, but say today's vote was bittersweet. The 20% pay cut they say was the hardest to swallow, especially when you're trying to support a family. Difficult day for those folks. Margot Spanner reporting. Margot, thank you very much.